Hey guys, so today I decided to recreate a face chart that I drew. So this is what it looks like here. Um, recently I've been like sketching some face charts because I feel like it will help me get my ideas out there and actually end up putting them on my face, which is pretty cool. I'm like peeling. If you'd like to see how I got this look, then please keep watching. First, I'm taking the NYX Vivid Brights in Vivid Blossom and Vivid Violet. And first, I'm taking the Vivid Blossom liquid liner and I am drawing some strokes towards the front of my brow. And then I'm taking the Vivid Violet and drawing some strokes at the tail of my brow. Next, I'm going in with Sigma's Lime Ace in the color pink and I am drawing a small wing today. And next, I'm going in with Suva Beauty's Bristol Hydro Cream Base with this Firma 206 brush. And I am first drawing like a wing from the bottom of the wing that I already drew. And then I'm going above it and drawing a line kind of in the wing crease area. Then I'm taking this Sigma E21 brush and I am softly blending out that edge. And then I'm going in and adding more of the Bristol Hydro Cream base with the Firma Beauty brush. And again, blending with the Sigma E21 brush. Next, breaking out my Kat Von D Me Vita Loca Remix palette, I'm taking the shade Analog, which is a nice orange, again on my Sigma E21 brush, and I am putting that over top of the Hydro Cream base. And then I'm taking a Zoeva 231 brush to slightly soften out the edges and make it a gradient. Next I'm taking the Luxie Beauty, I'll leave it in the description box below, blending that out. Adding more of that orange to the crease. And then blending with the Zoeva 231 brush. Next, just going in and adding more orange to the crease to make it darker. And again, blending with the Zoeva 231 brush. We want this to be like a nice gradient. Next, taking my Sigma E11 brush and some concealer, I am making that a nice sharp line there and making sure that the crease is pretty sharp. Next, I'm going in with NYX Vivid Petal Liquid Liner and I am drawing a small graphic line on the inner brow area. I don't know how to describe this area. But I'm drawing a curved line and then I am adding some thickness towards the center. So it's like you take off of a piece of a circle. Next I'm taking NYX's Azure Slide On Pencil and I'm applying this to my waterline and lower lash line. And then I'm going in with a pencil brush and just softening out the edge. Next I'm going into the Mi Vita Loca palette again and taking the shade Skulls and highlighting my brow bone. For lashes, I'm taking House of Lashes Featherette Lashes. Popping them on here. And this is the finished eye look. Moving on to the face, 
First I'm taking this NYX Wonder Pencil and I'm freehanding the headpiece part. So first I'm drawing a V and then I'm drawing a line inwards and then I'm drawing a line up. It's almost like a lightning bolt. So I'm drawing that back down, over, and then down again. And I'm using the Wonder Pencil first because if I mess up, this is easier to clean up than an actual color. Next, I'm taking Suva Beauty's Snow Queen Hydra Liner and this Sigma E17 brush, and I'm just filling in that design there. So I just switched to the uh, Sigma E11 brush, I think it's E11, or it's a very thin liner brush, I'll leave it in the description box below, and I'm doing the smaller details with this brush. And then I'm just cleaning up all of the outside lines with some concealer. And I'm just taking that Luxie Beauty 231 brush to, to blend that concealer into the skin. Fixing any parts that need it. And then I'm going in with the shade Destroyer from the Mi Vita Look palette with a MAC 239 brush. And I'm doing some color contouring. So I want it very sharp at the top side of the contour. So I'm really drawing that so there's a hard line there. And then pulling it down and blending. And here I'm taking the Cosette S165 brush to blend that downwards. Next I'm going into my NYX Strobe of Genius palette and I'm taking that lighter pink shade there and the pearly shade and I'm using a Sigma F03 brush and I'm applying that to the tops of my cheekbones. Doing some more blending. And next I'm going in with Kat Von D Aisha liquid lipstick and overdrawing my lips as usual. And this is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for this clip of me scaring the shit out of myself. <laughs> Bye guys. Oh my god. Oh my god.